I've been working on MS since uh, 26 years ago. It all started when I was uh, at the neurology residency, working in the MS clinic. I was struck by the fact that the only treatment at that time was uh, steroids, cortisone. After the residency, I, I did a PhD in uh, neuroimmunology, and then I became independent and I started to do uh, my own research on uh, immune cell biology and the role of immune cells in MS. Our lab uh, focuses uh, mostly on the environmental factors that trigger immune system. We have two major projects ongoing. One is uh, on the Epstein-Barr virus infections, and the second project is on the uh, gut bacteria. Many viruses like Epstein-Barr uh, are very common. Uh, we don't know how bad they can be for uh, our health, but uh, they are an important trigger for the immune system, and so uh, they have been involved with many diseases. Unfortunately, in some people, the EBV infection is a very bad trigger, and the immune system is not able to, to fight it in, in an appropriate way. Uh, there are already a couple of uh, uh, companies that are uh, uh, working on the EBV vaccine. Almost all diseases are the results of uh, an environmental trigger in our uh, uh, personal structures, so the genes. So the, the interface between environmental factors and genes uh, results very often in diseases. Each of us has different ways to uh, respond to virus and so also the capability to control the virus is depending on, on your genes. So now we are looking at uh, the mechanisms by which uh, the immune system is blocked in controlling the virus infections so that we can also uh, come out with a therapy, eventual therapy in this context. And this is going to be crucial both for prevention and for immunotherapy in, in patients, in MS patients. It's very important to have uh, 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 as many patients as possible and, and to compare the, the data uh, among different uh, countries. I believe in the future we will end up doing a personalized therapy so that each kind of uh, 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 you know, patients, relapsing, remitting, primary progressive, secondary progressive, we have uh, several alternatives in terms of treatments. So you, you basically has just to make a couple of tests in the future and see which is the best treatment for that specific patient.